Alright guys, I want to call this my one, two, three step video on how to set up your head unit. Okay, step number one, you want a 90 this servo arm. 90 degrees is, is this right here. That's 90 degrees. So, you want this servo arm as straight as you can get it. And the way you 90 that servo harm is with sub trim. You don't want to use sub trim or nothing else but the 90 that servo harm. After you use 90 that servo arm, the three servo arms with your sub trim will move on to step number two. Step number two, these two mixing arms here, you want to get them parallel. I like to remove these two linkages and push the swash plate up till they're parallel then I will lengthen or shorten this linkage while I'm holding it up there and pop it on there while it's there step number three then we're going to level a swash plate you can do that by eye I like to use a swash plate leveler if the swash plate isn't level when you're moving your throttle stick to full positive and full negative Lengthen or shorten the linkage until you get your swash plate level. Step number three. Then you want to zero the pitch on your blades. By adjusting these linkages right here with a pitch gauge, you will set both blades to zero pitch. After you set both blades to zero pitch, then you want to check your pitch. For example, if you got 13 degrees of positive pitch and 10 degrees of negative pitch, you want to lengthen or shorten all three of these. For example, uh, you want to give this one one turn, that one one turn, and that one one turn so it's, they stay together. If you do that and then you see now you have 14 degrees of pitch, um, you want to shorten these. The same amount of turns and that should solve your problem same thing with the tail servo you want it 90 degrees but the tail servo is going to be straight up and down with your 90 degrees like that there you're going to set all these up and idle up with your motor unplugged when you're setting up the tail servo you don't want the gyro on you don't want to be in uh, raid mode or heading hold, you want to be in raid mode, which is normal mode, which is a gyro being off. You want to make sure this this one is perfectly straight up and down with no sub trim. You can't use any sub trim on your tail servo. I never use any. So if it's not sitting uh, perfectly straight up and down, take that servo horn, turn it all around till it fits, or replace the servo horn. I think that's it. It's just that simple. If I missed anything, guys, somebody uh, let me know or post it in the topics below. Thanks for watching. It took me uh, three minutes to explain. It shouldn't take you no more than ten minutes or less to do. One last thing you want to use about 30% of the expo so that your stick isn't too uh, sensitive on a Futaba radio 30 positive makes your stick more touchy so you want to use negative expo if you got a spectrum a DX setup positive expo is negative so you want to add 30 positive because uh negative on the spectrum is positive. Thanks for watching.